you're an onion person, this is your lucky day. We're about to make something very delicious here, everybody. What we're doing is making a few little bowls here out of some onions. Now I got some very big onions, everybody. And you can definitely use this onion for something, whatever you want to put it on. You know. Once you get this started, you can just do the rest with a spoon. I got our uh, soup spoon. And when I say our soup spoon, I mean this is the only one. <laughs> <laughs> I actually bought another pack for you the other day. Get all your outer layer of the onion off. Okay, so do you need the, this part? We're gonna use that for something. I mean, are you gonna use it tonight? If not, I would be putting it in bags and Yeah, you can freezer. save it, yeah, okay. save it, because we'll definitely use it for something. Now tonight, y'all, what we are gonna be trying, this is gonna be a delicious, very delicious little deal. I'm gonna be making some barbecue uh, onion Let's see, let me, let me think what this could be called. Smoked barbecue sweet, let's see. A smoked barbecue sweet onion. Sweet barbecue onion bowls is what it's gonna be called. We're gonna pack it full of some uh, mushrooms, jalapeno peppers, smoked cheddar, ground beef. We're gonna wrap it with the right kind of bacon. The right brand. The right brand. Then we're gonna throw it on that green egg and smoke it for a little while. Everybody, I'm gonna show you something right here. Now I got some large, very large onions here. Okay. You can see they're very large. I mean, I've been trying to make my hands not smell like onions, but let's just forget it. It's gonna happen. It's just, yeah, it's gonna happen. Just... All we're doing is making it where it will stand up on the grill. So you see that? Perfect. Take you something and just kind of start breaking this up a little bit. Don't go real, real deep, you know, and just turn it around. That's all we're gonna do, just do some little holes like this. Once you get the little holes started, it's pretty simple from there. You just take your soup spoon. Your soup spoon like they only got one. <laughs> carving it out. <laughs> if you got kids, you probably only got one. If you had, if you even got one. <laughs> what do they do with spoons? We don't know. They use it to dig stuff They go car. grab it and use it for a shovel, and then they go use my shovel for something else. And before it's all over, we'll be confused. We got shovels in here eating soup and <laughs> cereal with in the morning time, and our spoons are in the shop. I see you brought home some Coca-Colas. For the kids. I want them to be happy as they're losing our spoons. <laughs> Y'all feel these good and then you can go outside and sit on the porch tonight and there won't be no mosquitoes by the end. That's why I keep mosquitoes off me. Yeah, everybody, I mean, they don't know I it, but I... keep one mosquitoes. Yeah, I just rub one on me all every morning. Ew. That's unusual. <laughs> I noticed that... You matched me a little bit today again. He does that on purpose sometimes, y'all. He acts like he didn't. Because I'm in love. We're gonna have a little onion soup night here. Mm-hmm. Saved over to the side. I'm telling y'all, you can learn a lot from Tom Sawyer. Daddy in here making this onion peeling look like fun. Look, volunteers everywhere. And People's somebody's calling <laughs> wanting to come. Hold on, baby, let me have it. I'll tell them. It's spam. All right, let me tell them. It's probably somebody wanting to <laughs> Onion soup, onion bowls. Come on over. You want to sell something? I'm sorry, you got the wrong number. This is onion soup. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, he really did that. What did the person say? Well, the people call all the time. It's spam. It says spam on the caller ID. Yeah. No, these people call all the time. How they get your number, who knows? They're just trying to trick you. They're trying to take things from us. <laughs> and it's like, listen, pal, you're not taking our onions. Yeah. This is onion soup, okay? Onion bowls. I would never do that if it was somebody. A real serious. person, yeah. That was a real person. Yeah, but it's spam. It's yeah. like it was you somebody know. calling from another country, probably wanting to try to get personal information, mm -hmm. telling me that uh, you know some account or something I've got is froze and they need my credit card number. Or my yeah, card. we always get the Netflix accounts frozen. We don't even have a Netflix account. <laughs> I'm like, buddy, you listen, you talking to somebody that on my butt, my front porch right there and burns fires at night. I don't watch Netflix, okay? I eat onions, bud. <laughs> if you don't need any onions, you got the wrong number. And this is not the right one, baby. This is regular Coke, okay? You don't spam me, buddy. All right, y'all, now I got one right here. This is the size of a little pumpkin. Make anything fun in life. If you'll make it look fun, everybody else will right. be, you can be the boss. That's what man. Tom Sawyer did with painting that fence. Whitewashing it, making it look like the funnest thing ever. That's what I'm trying to do a horseshoe and somebody jump around there. <laughs> can I drive one of them down? I'll be like, you sure can, buddy, but look now, I'm about to charge you and the customer. Mom, if you want to have fun like this right here, you cannot get too aggressive with this core because you'll, you'll mess up the boat. 
That's what I was trying to tell that guy on the phone just a second. I'm mad about it. I'm making my peanut butter sandwich. I want to see. I want to see, Mama. You want to see? Uh, <laughs> see it? Yeah, it looks weird now. I'm just to the point in my life that I really don't like all these people that just get our numbers from these different places and call me all day long and send me text messages about the train station being stopped. Oh, yeah. And all like that drives me crazy. <laughs> message almost every day about train something is delayed delayed and i'm like i'm not even riding that train <laughs> and i'm sure not trying to rob it all right mama this is a lot of onion right here sure enough we'll save this onion right here yeah, put it I'm in like it. some carrot soup why don't we just make like tomorrow we'll make a carrot soup it's an early fall <laughs> anyway we're having some strange weather y'all it's been pretty cool actually that could be what's happening with our garden yeah it could we've been be. talking about it Giving up the ghost. It's so, but it's, some of it's still fine. Still fine. It's we're holding well, we haven't on. We've looked at it in a few hours. We're holding. <laughs> we're holding on. This is where you want to take this to the next level. This is Wisconsin cheddar. It's smoked really, really good. And this is some of the best. Uh, Jonah's eating some. <laughs> he's eating some now. <laughs> it's uh, it's the boar's head too. I think yeah. pepper jack. Pepper jack. Getting a little cheese there, skater back. I like that stuff. You like that stuff? Mm -hmm. I like the smoke. You like the smoke cheese? We're going to put that much ground beef, everybody. Steak King. That's probably enough right there. Okay. Now we're gonna go in with just a little bit of this Shire sauce. <laughs> Worcestershire? Just a little bit of this here, barbecue sauce. Now we're gonna, mix. we're gonna mix that up real well. You think you did it good enough? Yeah, I did it good. Okay. You talking to somebody made a lot of meatloafs. Okay. A lot of meatballs in my time. Okay. Well, see, we do have more soup spoons. I bought a pack. Well, I was I two packs. Girl. I bought two more. packs, yeah. I liked having just that one. Now let's get us a few mushrooms. Just relax to that chop. Close your eyes and go back into your childhood to a more simple place. I remember one summer Goodness, I took her back to the summer of her childhood. You know how I see, right? Yep. Well, uh, I love them still seat. today. Well, we loved them when we were kids. I mean, we absolutely love high seat, especially the fruit punch flavor. Y'all might want to get you a napkin. <laughs> this could get to be <laughs> no, a very, so very, very emotional. Well, they hosted a little uh, sweepstakes thing where they were coming out for a little while they put their high C in a can and they were doing this uh, deal where you help them name what they call the high C in a can you know okay do y'all remember this out there in and YouTube the little card would be in a package of high C and you filled it out and then you mailed it in you know anyway yeah you sent you mailed it in so me and Blake Blake's my nephew y'all he's just three years younger than me but we Sat outside, I remember, for who knows how long thinking up names that they could call this high C in a can. Blake, do you remember that? If I remember right, we went with kicking a can. Kicking a can? Okay. We didn't win. Blake. We did not win. Alrighty, now we're going to introduce our new high C, kicking a can. <laughs> this is high C. It didn't last long either. They just had those probably... I don't even know, not long. All right, everybody, look at that. That's a real beautiful thing across this little log. And now we're gonna dump it right into that meat. Just these two. Just like that right there. Bring in your mushrooms. That's it. That's y'all out there now pondering <laughs> that. What are we gonna call it? I mean, we could win this thing. How about kicking a kid? <laughs> we had a bunch of different names picked out. If they would have named it that, it might have lasted longer. We might still be having kicking a can today, y'all. You never, never know. know. You never know. So you're gonna do cheese on the bottom, meat yeah. mixture, cheese yeah. on the top. Exactly. Wrap in bacon. Yeah. Let's see okay. if we can just set them up. That almost sounded like a little song. Well, why don't cheese we on the bottom, start a band? Cheese on the top. The name of the band can be kicking a can. <laughs> 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 
it was these two people pulled up in a white minivan with the flames on the side. They called their band kicking a can. Let's see. What we Said he was a cowboy rapper. Just a wild cow catcher. <laughs> On the green pastures. Oh, well, this is getting good, Mom. Get some paper, uh, please. I'm writing. I'm writing a number one wait, song right now. Wait, we gotta put the cheese on the bottom. Okay. Wait, we put the cheese on the bottom. Let's go with jalapeno uh, cheddar. The pepper jack. Pepper jack on okay. the bottom. It's almost like a cheeseburger with onions. Inside out. Mm -hmm. Right. If you're looking for a low carb situation, there you go. No, no bread in, is necessary here. Although we do have some rolls over here. We're gonna be rolls. toasting up. I'm gonna toast them up. <laughs> But you can leave that off if you want to. There we go, right there. Put a little cheddar, smoked cheddar, mm -hmm. on the top. Where'd you say those toothpicks were? Basically, you got a little bacon cheeseburger right there. Everybody, here it is. Let's see what we got. got one toothpick in there, I think. I'm gonna do a little surgery. Heaven forbid. That's what we got right there. Looks like a cheeseburger inside an onion. You don't have to get aggressive to get a hold of this thing, everybody. I'm gonna tell you something. That thing's fighting me. All right, now we got it. All right, good. Okay, everybody, now one thing I gotta say, I wanna tell you this, because this is very important if you're gonna do these right here. They're very good, they're delicious. One thing you wanna make sure of is that you control that temperature on that grill. Make sure you keep it at about 300 degrees. Don't need it to go over 300. If you do, you'll do like I did. Scorch your bacon and have to take it off. Take all the bacon off and re-bacon it. <laughs> I'm telling you, with that cheese and everything in there, it makes it really, really delicious. <laughs>